24. You still can step outside, come on. Can I don't trust me, sir. I didn't, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't do I anything. Step, I'm asking you to step outside. You're not doing it. Why are you putting your hands on I'm, me? I'm asking you to step outside. But you violate I'm my asking, rights. No, what I'm are you not. talking about? Yes, outside. you are. You trust me to step outside. How am I, what, what law did I break? What law did I break? You putting your hands Don't tell me. Don't put your hands on me. Can I get a supervisor's location? I've been, I've, I've been through this already. I understand, but step outside. Can you? What are you doing? Step outside. Look, if you step outside, can you? I'm why are you putting your hands on me like that? Outside. I'm asking you to step outside. Don't, hey, don't push me back. Don't I'm put your hands on. What are you putting your hands on me for? Step outside. Step outside. You doing all this? No, you don't. You don't have. Listen, you don't have outside. no right to put your hands. You don't on. got no right to be in here. What? What did I? What step law outside. did I break? What law did I break? You gonna step outside or you gonna go to jail? Which one? So now the threat of arrest. Let's go. Then. What's going on, good citizens? Yeah, today we back at the Baltimore. Uh, what is it called? Uh, social services building. Now, we came up before and uh, to get a do IPI request, which we didn't get to complete. Um, we had an issue with the uh, security guards or what have you. So we did process that uh, complaint, talk to them about it. They said, you know, they'll talk to them about, you know, being able to report in public and let them know what they, you know, can and cannot do or what have you. Uh, so we back to verify that however keep in mind uh we it was identified that this was a children's uh social service building and we don't want to record any children just something i don't want to do part of my policy so uh if, if i do see any children uh i will i will I'll definitely back up out of there uh there, there was also that unconstitutional sign that we identified that was on the counter so we gonna also go in there and see if that sign is still present. And if it is, uh, we could try to get that removed. Uh, I saw a lot of stuff in the comments about it. And I mean, yeah, we're definitely right about that. So we'll go in here, see if we can get a real staff member. And then uh, try to do our PIA request. They look like they are open. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, I came to talk to uh, some of the staff member. I uh, came here like a month ago, and yeah, part of the, the social service. Yeah. Thank you. So it does look like they have locked the door, but the. That sign is gone. So that is something that we definitely wanted to do. Thank you. All right, y'all hang tight. Y'all put that back on. No, I didn't, I didn't. When I came originally, uh, there was a lady. I talked to any employee member, but uh -huh. the, the guard that was on duty prevented me from engaging with any employees of this building. So okay. I just need anybody can come out. I talked to any of them. Um, he said he came about last month and he wanted to speak to staff members. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm going to be quiet. So anyway, he does. Seem like they have been educated. That's good. Uh, I mean, this is a pleasant visit this time, so it seems anyway, so. He's not in the building. I'm recent on the talking to him, but he's not in the building. Okay, hello. Good, how you doing? Yeah, yeah. Oh, absolutely, yeah. Tell him what I came here to do a PIA request, a Public Information Act uh, request. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. Mm -hmm. it, it, I mean, I, I, I don't prefer not to. I mean, my first, my name Mac. I can tell you that. I don't mind. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. They come out here. Right. I can fill it out, fill it out, and I can give it to any employee. They're routed to the right personnel. Right. They don't have to be the, the PI person. Right. I can. I, right. And then, you know, I'll be on my way. 
I appreciate it. Thank you. All right. EJ ain't going to send somebody out here. Okay. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Paul. Yeah. So he, he's going to send someone out? Yeah, he said he's going to send somebody out. I don't know how this one Yeah. See, they changed some policies or something. There used to be a sign. Because I came here and I had a big... That was what the fiasco was about that, you know, because I, I record any time I engage in with, like, government employees or government buildings. And that's where the, that's where it all just went left. And there was a sign that was right there. that said, you can't record and take pictures and all that stuff. And I was like... What are you talking about? And they called the police. Police came down. Right. We know what happened to the, the other people that was working here, or is y'all on different shifts? Or? Different shifts. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so you just Okay, so I don't know if you've seen the building right there, the 1910. Okay, so no, I don't go down. Oh, wow. It's another building. What's that building? That's 1910. It's all the same. So they Is it people in that building? Yeah. Is kids in that building? I don't know if it's kids in the building, but okay. I know it's the both buildings are the same. Okay. Yeah, so he would say basically if you go in there, security can send you up to administration. Yeah, that's what I need. You. Okay. I appreciate that. And you, uh, can I see a patch? Are you with no. the same company? No, this, this badge? No, I'm not. Oh, that is different. P Chain? <laughs> yes. They got two different security that wrote. Yeah. So it's P Chain and another one is, uh, what's the other one? Admiral. That's right. Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. And can I get your name? Do you mind? Oh, Gaines. Gaines? I appreciate it. You'd be very helpful. Yeah, very professional. Appreciate it. 1910. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. So, we'll just walk down here real quick. Um, try to take care of this. Do a PI request down there, and uh, yeah, we'll record that building too, and uh, see if they respect our our rights recording public. Yeah, let's see if they respect our rights to record in public. In the public accessible areas. So yeah, let's do that. And on. Yeah. They told me to come down to this building to talk to administration. I just came from another building. So, Constable, you, um, you can't record in here. Why not? You can't record. It's against policy. Police will call. What can't do that. So, this is the same sign that was at the other building, that it, but it's unconstitutional. It's going right? to be all social service um, buildings. You can't record. But I can record. Can. Okay, well, you can just step off the premises because you cannot record. I'm not. I'm not going nowhere. Okay, I mean, you can call the police. You can call I mean, we don't, you don't have to, but. Well, if you, you can't record. But I can't, who made this You property? can't record on social service. This is social service property. You want me to, I can break it down to you if you. If you, you don't have to break anything to me. You can call no one. Okay. Well, can y'all call the administration? This is administration. We can't call anybody. They just told me to come over here. You can call the 911 or you can just exit off the premises. You know, recording on public property. You know, just public Sir, property. You can step right? out the building. I'm not going out the you building. You can step out the building. I'm not going out the building. Okay, that's fine. You know, this is public property, right? And I can record on public property. It's a constitutionally protected activity. Y'all recording right there? I thought we. I thought we resolved this. And I talked to y'all company. Y'all company, they, they know. Sir, exit out. Do not come nowhere near this door. You can exit out. You you, you can't stop me from you recording. How you doing? Right. I am at 1910 North Broadway. We have a gentleman in here. He refuses to leave. He's in here recording me telling him that he cannot. I can just social call service. administration. I'd be on my way. Nineteen ten North Broadway. Nineteen ten North Broadway. 
I'll give you mine. Four, four, three. Okay. Off the ground. Hopefully they'll tell y'all that. They'll tell y'all that I can, hopefully. Yeah, we can just keep going with like this. Pretty accurate description. Yeah. Glasses, sunglasses, type thing. Um, he's making us very uncomfortable. <sighs> okay, thank you. Can y'all tell administration was down here? Sir, just no, exit out the building. Sir, just exit out the building. Well, why would I run now? Y'all can call the police. Your options are to leave. Or what? What am I doing? Go to jail, I guess. Come on, man. Really doesn't matter. You know I can record, right? I didn't ask you that. But the sign clearly says that you can't record. It's sign on me. It's private property. Who owns this property? Not you. You sure? I'm positive. Okay. I mean, please come out here to educate. Sir, I'm not going to go back and forth with you. You can leave. Well, I'm not going to run now. Y'all call the police. Why would I run? Run for the police. Just exit away from that door. Hey, don't touch, don't well, touch me. No, you don't get away from the me. door. Exit away hey, from the do door. Do not touch me. Exit away from the door. I'm not going to move. Do not touch so, like me. like I said, just exit away don't from touch the door. Me, Exit away from the door. I'm not gonna move. Exit away from the you door. Better not touch me. You don't touch me. You can I exit away from you. the door. I'm not moving. You can exit away from the door. You, yes, you, we had to call the police. Exit away from the door. You recording too? Then you just said you can't record. I'm recording. Exit away from but the you, door. But you said you can't exit record. Exit away from the door. You said you can't record. Why, why are you recording? Yes. Hi, why are you recording? You can leave. Well, you hold on to that. That's that's. Yes, I thought, I'm saying yeah. Go ahead. I'm not going nowhere. Come on. Go ahead. Don't touch me. As long as you don't touch me, we'll be all right. You want today? Hmm? You today? Mm. Are we good? Y'all mind calling administration down here? Hello? Yes, he is. I don't want to come. They know I'm here. Okay. You ain't got to be so nasty about it. You can leave. We've asked you multiple times. Yeah, but that's... The same exact thing. But why, why would I... To leave. For what, though? Why are you here? Uh, to talk to the dude. You're not talking to them. Okay. That's the same. Same company. Uh, that's crazy. You know I can record anything my eyes can see, right? We stop recording. You are miserable, sir. You can leave. I'm not going nowhere. That's fine. 
I hope you go to jail. Come on now, why would we want that? You're not recording nothing. That's bad here. Close the window just close the door. There you go. Create privacy. You don't want to answer the phone? Excuse me? Yeah, he coming in. Okay. Yeah, he recording too. You gonna tell him not to record? No. Yeah, he should be recording. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. For what? Could you? What business do you have here? Uh, I was sent over here. I went to that other building over there to talk to the uh, PIA representative. Sorry, mm -hmm. PIA request, which I'm allowed by law, state law. Uh, they sent me over to this building. They talked to, I guess, the administration on the other end. He told me to come to this building so I could submit my PIA request. So he said, they said. You don't have business here. They, I need you to step out. We're not going to go back and forth. I, I do have business here. This, he just this said is, you don't, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to tell you what you my business tell is. Nothing, right, tell me outside. I'm not going outside. You're going to go outside you're going to go to jail for trespassing. It's your choice. Can I get a supervisor? 20, 24. You still can step outside. Come on. Can I don't touch me, sir. I didn't, buy, I, didn't, I didn't do I'm anything. Step, I'm asking you to step outside. You're not doing it. Why are you putting your hands on I'm, me? Because I'm asking you to step outside. But you violate I'm my asking, rights. No, what are you talking about? Yes, outside. you are. You trespass to step outside. How am I? What, what law did I break? What, what law did I break? You putting your hands Don't tell me. Don't you put your hands on me. You're not coming across. Can I get a supervisor's location? I've been, I've, I've been through this already. I understand, but step outside. With, can you? What are you doing? Step outside. Look, if you step outside, can you? I'm why are you putting your hands on me you like step that? Outside. I'm asking you to step outside. Don't, hey, don't push me back. Don't I'm put your hands on. What okay. are you putting your hands I'm on me you for? Step outside. Just step outside. You doing all this? No, you don't. You don't have. Listen, you don't have outside. no right to put your hands. You don't on. got no right to be in here. What? What did I? You what law outside. did I break? What law did I break? You gonna step outside or you gonna go to jail? Which one? So now the threat of arrest. Let's go there. Your supervisor on the way, right? Yeah. Gentleman. That's definitely assault. It's not assault. That I mean, is assault. assault. No, it's not. You put your head for what reason? I didn't buy, I didn't break no law. No law. No law. You know you messed up, right? Trespassing. Trespassing is a second, a secondary offense. Trespassing. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. What? No, it's not. How am I trespassing on public property? It's not public. That's the thing. It's not public. This is not public? It's not public. No. Then what is this? No. It's private? Did Who owns it? Did you ask for a supervisor? I did. Okay. You talked to him one But I can talk. I got freedom of speech. Right. I said, did you ask for a supervisor? I did ask for a supervisor. Okay. You shouldn't put your hands on me. Definitely filed a, filed a complaint on you. What is it? Bail? Yes, sir. Badge number what? 1208? 1208. Yeah, you definitely shouldn't have done that. How you doing? How you doing, sir? I'm off this blog. Everything is automatically recorded. Appre you a supervisor or are you just. His. I'm Ms. Baker. What's the problem? Okay. It wasn't no problem, right? I came over here to do a PI request with this building over here. I talked to the administration that was on the other end. I can't, I've been at this building before about a month ago. I had no issue. Talked to the same thing, Baltimore police, no issue, right? Came back, he said, okay, they had nobody in the back right now in that building. He said, go over to 1901 or 1910 and the administration, they uh, let me do my PI request here. I said, okay, I walked over here. They got an issue with it. They say, hey, they not gonna call the administration. He tracking, I'm on the way. They said, you can't record in this building. I'm like, it's public property. I can record all my engagement on public property, right? They got an issue with that. This officer right here gonna put his hands on me, push me out the building. Definitely should have done that. I didn't break no law. I came peacefully. I told him exactly why I'm here. And he pushed me out the building. Technically, I no, you you push me out the building. Right. I gotta I gotta I record it. You back up. No, I, you push me. Okay, well then I push you. Push you push me. Okay, then you then then he removed me under threat of arrest.
you're trespassing. I'm not trespassing. They asked you to leave. This is their building. They asked it is you not to their leave. building. It is, it is their not building. their building. Okay. They ain't the security, but it's not their building. You're right. So when they asked you to leave, do they, you want to leave? They, they don't have the right to tell me to leave. They don't have that right. I have business here. Sir, they do have a right. They do un, not unless I violate or break a law. Yes, yes, I can. So, so why did they say they needed you out of? Because they didn't want me to record. Okay. That is a constitutionally protected activity. Okay. They cannot tell me that. Okay. So they they wanted you out of this building. Right. Because you were recording. Correct. And they felt uncomfortable. Okay. Were you going to leave willingly out of the building? After I did my business, yes. No, because they they wanted you out of the building at that very moment, right? They did, yes. Right. So upon the request, we have to also request you to leave. That's how. That they, works, right? So wait, wait, wait a minute. Okay. So that, that's how that works. If you refuse to leave, then you'll be there for trespassing. And then we will have to remove you. We don't want to do that, but that's just how it goes. You know what I'm saying? What I'm saying? So, yeah. Can, can I talk now? Yeah, you can talk. Great. So this this building, right, this is uh, the Department of Social Services. Yes. It, it is a public building. Sure it is. It is a public building, right? I have the so right. So it's the police department. So it's the police. I, and I've been in police department. But, but, but if we tell you you got to go, you got to go. Now, here's the thing, right? Am I right or wrong? It, it depends. No, it doesn't. No, yes, it does. On what? Right? Because as long as I'm in public accessible areas, I can, I can record. And I also can record. No, no, no. You, that's not answering my question. This is a public building. Just like a police department is a public building. Correct. Right, so if we ask you to leave, you are in our building. You can ask, and I can deny that request. And then you'll be removed. No, and then that'll be a violation of my rights. Okay. Right, and then I'll, I can handle it as such. Right? You can. Right. This is definitely a violation. We definitely don't file a complaint on him. Sure. Right, and, and then we'll handle it like that. No big deal. He shouldn't have put his hands on me. Okay. At all. I wasn't here for that. All I'm saying right. is that's how the procedure works with trespassers or people that aren't willing to go when they want to go. Right, but I have to violate the law or some especially on public property for to be trespassed i didn't do anything to be trespassed when you were told where there is a public for, building if you were told by security i'm getting pretty sure you were told by security right correct when you are told by security in a public building where is the mall where there is the police department where there is this building you have to leave because you are recording they, they might have their apology you are recording and we don't want you here no more and you don't want to they, they can't put their hands on you. They call us, and you don't want to be willingly leave, then we have to remove you. And we if don't you want do, to do that, but we, that's just right. how it and goes. If, and if you do, that would be infringing on my constitutional rights, okay. which, which is fine. I just filed a complaint because that is a violation. He definitely violated my constitutional rights, okay. and it's you know no big deal. You have the right to do whatever you want about whatever, right. but I'm just telling you how the procedure works with us. Right, and again, I've dealt with y'all, right, plenty of times, right? So, so you it's, should know a little bit. Right, so again, right, I have the same thing. I see people come down here, no problem. Okay. Cleared it up. Can I get your name and badge number, ma'am? Can I get your name and badge number? Said this happened before and you had a supervisor come around correct and what happened and he informed them that i have the right to record in public okay. as long as i'm in public accessible areas not going past any you know locked doors or anything of that nature okay you all aware that social security bill is a federal property right what that mean you're not allowed to record a federal property why you keep saying that okay I just, I just want you to know, you're saying you know so much, I'm just advising you, but if you don't want me to say it, can I record on federal properties? You, you know that. You can definitely record on no, federal properties. You cannot record inside of any federal property anytime. You Are you sure? I'm positive. I, I unless recorded. You have, I'm sorry, let me rephrase that. Unless you have permission to record. I got permission. Okay. You say you got permission. You got I do. Wait, from where? The Constitution. No. Once again, you cannot record on federal <laughs> properties. Oh, uh, get out of here with that, bro. You need to be retrained, man. You need to be retrained? Yeah, you do. Knowledge is key. Oh, you're right. We definitely gonna make sure you get it, though. How's it going? Hey, good, how are you? I'm all right, I'm sorry I'm late. Yeah, 
Sergeant Dollar Bowman, please follow me via audio video recorder, all right? Okay, you got a badge on, sir? Yeah, it's uh, 501. Hey, I appreciate that. Yeah, no problem. Uh, give, me, so, uh, give me one second. Oh, okay. That'd be a secret conversation. So, uh, you wanted to speak to me? Oh, absolutely. Uh, I request you out here because I went to this building over here, a uh, social service building, mm -hmm. uh, which I, I was here about a month ago, right, to do a PI request okay. uh, with them. Uh, they didn't have anybody available at the time, but the one person I had an issue with the security guard at the time, so I was like, I'll, just, I'll come back at a later date. Okay. Right. Uh, came back, apparently they don't have nobody in the back, so they said go over to the, uh, 1910. Uh, I talked to the administration personnel, whoever was in the back, uh, the security person called them. He said, just come over here and I could, I could file my PI request uh, with them and they'll, they'll take care of it. Okay. I said, no problem. I came in here, talked to the security person at this desk and they said, hey, you can't record in this building, right? Okay. I told him, I said, I can't record in here. It's, it's, uh, it's public property, right? It's a constitutionally protected activity. Uh, they said, no, we're gonna call the police. They called you guys immediately, okay. right? Uh, as soon as he get here, uh, he asked them, they said, hey, he can't record, he gotta go. He said, hey, you gotta leave right now. Mm -hmm. Shove me out the door, right? Okay. Push me out the door. He said, I walk backwards or whatever. No, I got it all recorded. He pushed me out the door. Then, you know, I was like, I'm, I don't wanna leave this building, right? It's public property. He said, hey, if you don't leave right now, I'm gonna arrest you, Okay. right? So all I wanna do is come here, file my PI request. I know that I can record on this ground. There's plenty of case law that states that. It's also, like I told you before, a constitutionally protected activity okay. that I can record all government officials in the course of their duties, all right? right? In, as long as I'm in public accessible areas, not passing any like locked doors or anything of that nature. Okay. So that's where we are right now. All right. So the security is saying that you are not allowed in there, okay? That has nothing to do with us. That's their policy. That's the building policy. Right. All right. So on that part, they're saying that they don't want you there. At, th at that point, it's a trespassing issue, okay? That's where we come in. Okay. We have nothing to do with the camera or anything like that. Right. They're saying you can't you can't record in there. Mm -hmm. You have to leave. Mm -hmm. If you well, refuse well, to leave, then it's a trespassing well, issue, and that's where we come in. Right. right? And that's what the officer did. Yeah. So trespassing based off of what crime? Based right? off of their policy, they don't. They, they don't I didn't commit a crime though. Okay. So how can you trespass me? I didn't so, commit a crime. What crime? So their policy is they don't want you in there. You they can't. Don't, they don't want you in there. For recording. They told you they don't want you For in recording. There. Okay. They told you they don't want you in there. Right. You refuse to leave. That's a trespass. Right. But only they can enforce law. You can. Okay. Right. You That's can enforce law. That's where we law. came in. Right. That's so what we did. If you decide to trespass me, right, for recording... Then we'll 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 take it that way because that's what the crime is that they're saying that I did. Okay. The crime is recording, okay, right? Which is a definitely a no, constitutional protected activity. That's the yes, it is. That they're, they're, no. they're saying that you were refusing. The to policy file. that they're saying I broke is because I'm recording. Okay, right? You cannot trespass me because I'm recording in public accessible areas. Okay, that, that you can't do it. Right. Right. And if you decide to do it, I just file a complaint. It's no big deal. Okay, that's fine. Do you want to file a complaint right, right now? So if okay. you tell if you tell me that I'm being trespassed for recording. They don't want you in that building? Because I'm recording. Yes. For recording. They don't want you in there. For recording. That's up to them. Why? Sir, I just spoke to them. They said that you were in there causing a disturbance. I, I got it on camera. I didn't cause no disturbance. I can show you right now. That's fine, but I'm just telling you what they told us. And, and, that's, and this is why they want you out of the building because you will call them disturbance. Not I, only just recording, but just call them disturbance. Well. Think, think about what you're saying right now. Right? There is it's nothing in there. I walked over into this building and said, hey, they sent me over here to talk to the administration in the back so I can file a PI request. Did that sound like a disturbance? Sir, I'm just. That's not us to distinguish. And, but let's, let's, let's for 30 seconds. It's not us to distinguish that. They called us and said we want him out of the building. They had the right to put you out of their building. For what reason? See, it's not their building. It is that they, they it's not. In the it's building. people's building. Okay. You, 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 you 
wanted to be your way. They wanted you out. The moment they asked you to leave and you chose not to, it was trespassing. For what crime? Listen. What crime? They want you out the building. For what crime? They, want you out the they can't just yes, they sure. can't just say I, I, I want you to leave. I explained it to you. But listen, listen to what I'm they, saying. I listen they to you. Wanted you to leave for a reason. Your house and you asking to leave. Is that trespassing? That's private property, right? Okay. So they can't just say I want you to leave. That's a violation of my rights. Okay, well, you can complain to them about that. Where we come in is they don't want you in that building. Right. You refuse to leave. That's your trespassing issue. That's where we come in. You gonna okay? You gonna don't, don't argue with me about their policy. You gonna trespass like for that. what crime? You're trespassing because they don't want you in that building. So for what crime? What crime, sir? I don't have to give you a crime. You you can't just trespass just to trespass. Okay. Do you want to make a complaint? Oh, absolutely, definitely on him. Okay. For sure. But you again, right? If you said on how to trespass, right? You gonna write me a ticket for trespass? Write me a ticket. All right, so we at this police department now. I'm about to file this complaint. Eastern District. I don't know. In a police department? We can't even record it. I got a camera. Is that? Oh, 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 oh. You can't do it in the courthouse. I can do it in the police department. It's public property. I record it in any, any police department. Oh. Yeah, I came to file a complaint and as well as talk to somebody of a higher authority, like a, a chief, a lieutenant, or, or something. Okay, can you explain to me what it is? Yes, I just, like the issue? No, what you need to speak to them for? Right, about the issue I have with some of your officers down at the Baltimore uh, Social Service Building. I just left there. Which, uh, which one are you at? 1910. 1910. 1910. Okay. Yeah. So, you, so what's going on? I can't file a complaint. Complaint? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, sounds good. So we have a form here. Okay. okay. Um, and then I'm supposed to get this back to you. This right here. So you're gonna get you're gonna get a copy. Okay. You're gonna get the yellow copy. And then I'll take this and I'll do. I don't. Well, well, I got a complaint on you. I don't want to give it to you. Oh, you're complaining on me? Oh, all oh, y'all. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Fair, that's fine. All right, I'll get you somebody I, else. I take that, though. Can I have it? Well, I mean, somebody else has to give it to you. If you don't want me to give it to you, somebody else has to. You know what I mean? No, nah, I don't why you can't just give me a piece of paper, though. It's a piece of paper. Because I can fill it somebody out. else is going to give it to you. You want to complain on me, that person's going to give it to you. You okay. understand? If I give it to you, I'm taking the complaint. Okay. You don't want to give the complaint to me. All right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. Is this this the captain of the building? Or this Eastern District? Is this I mean, this is this is your captain. When does he, when does he come? Can I talk to him? Oh, I mean, when is he gonna is he gonna be here tomorrow? I'm just saying, I'll, I'll come back. Because I don't, don't want to be here hung up on. Right. So I got to go up the time to lose. He knew. The, okay. So wait. Some more. All right. Good citizen. Yeah, we back at this Eastern District Police Station, Baltimore. It's like a third time here. The time I came before is 
Unfortunately, it was like around like four. Now I was saying nobody here and stuff like that. So I decided to come a little early this time. It's 11, 12 a.m. 16 April. So yeah, I just wanna talk to a lieutenant, somebody, somebody who I haven't talked to because this is crazy. So let's see what we do. Yeah, I came to speak to like a lieutenant or somebody of a higher authority. I came in here uh, last week twice, but apparently nobody was here. So they told me to come back during the daytime. I was trying to file a complaint. Well, one was on you. Okay. Officer Bell. Okay. And I think that was it. Okay. But I came, yeah, I came here and everybody was gone apparently that day. So, yeah, uh, yeah. twice. For the, so. most, for the most part, they'd be on the street. Right. Yeah, okay. Yeah, sorry. But, um, let me, let me, let me try to raise and see if they, um, if they are not busy right now. Yeah. Is it a uh, another sergeant or what is it? Is there anybody above a sergeant? Uh, All I get is sergeant. Let you know if, okay. That's I understand that. Do you know who the sergeant is? No. They don't we don't go by name. I, I just I don't know that I so I don't know. Okay. I appreciate it. Thank you. How you doing? Sergeant Clay, hello? Sergeant Clay, you know. Eastern District. We're being recorded by my camera as well. How can I help you? Uh, yes, yeah, so I had an issue about, um, hell, I was uh, almost two weeks now, um, out at the Baltimore Social Service Building. Uh-huh. And where I, I, they had an issue with me recording in that building. Yeah. Um, and then I was you know, pushed out of that building by Officer Bell. And, uh, by Officer who? Bell. Bell. So how many times did you go there? Once. Yeah, officer. I, there was another incident at the same exact location, same thing, don't record in our building situation, but it wasn't Officer Bell. That's where I get confused. Right, so yeah. This one was pushed out. Do you wish you a. Yeah, this one was Officer Bell. Uh, so you were there more than one time? So? No, in 1910. Uh, I, I know. No, 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 it was only there once. Only the one time. It was only okay. once. Okay. Yeah. Somebody else did it too. Okay. Yeah, I was only the one. recording in there. Okay. Uh, yeah, I was, I was there. I was pushed out by Officer Bell. Then. Uh, I'm sorry. Can you tell me the exact date? Yeah. Is that possible? Yeah, yeah. I'll tell you. April 9th. About what time? About 3, 3 o'clock. 3, yeah, about 3, 3.30. 1910 Broadway. So you had a discussion with the security there who asked you not to film inside and then they called the police? Correct. Officer Bell, who was the responding officer? Correct. And how you uh, describe what happened? Uh, so I made contact with the admin personnel of the social service building. They told me to go over to 1910, talk to the guard, they'll buzz me in. Right? Or he'll come down one of the or. I go over there, I say, hey, I'm here to talk to the admin person. If you can just, you know, call them, they'll come down. And then at that point, it was like, hey, you can't record in this building, et cetera, et cetera. I said, I know I can record in this building if you just call the guard, I mean, call the admin person, hey, everything will be okay. 
They said, we're not calling nobody. And then they just called the police. Officer Bell came over to the site. Uh, I tried to inform him of what was going on. He didn't want to hear any of that. Pretty much like, you got to get out of the building right now. They don't want you here. They said you're causing a disturbance. I said, I said, you know, one sentence to them. I don't understand what, you know, how am I causing a disturbance? He said, hey, they said they want you out. You're causing a disturbance. You got to go right now. I said, can you call a supervisor? Call a supervisor. The officer's name was uh, Officer Delard that was a responding supervisor. Officer who? Delard. You know what I'm talking about? Delard. Don't no, Delard. Uh, let's see. Dollar. Dollar. J. Dollar. Yeah. So he called, hey, how, how you doing? Was this the same guy that you had? Yes. Was he here at the time you? No, it wasn't. That was in 1910. You talking about, uh, yeah, you talking about the other one. This is 1910. So it was a different building. It's two different buildings. Two different buildings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two different buildings. Yeah. The building that, the building that I encountered with him. Yeah, the building I talked to him was the one that I talked to the minister. I thought it was the same person, but yeah, that, yeah. You know, in the same parking lot. They got yeah, the minister wasn't there that day. He told me to come back, so I went back, right? But instead of going to that building, he told me to go to 1910. The administrator or admin personnel that I needed to talk to. Okay. So, but he wasn't there that day, so I had to come back. Okay. So that's why I went to 1910. Okay. Right? So... Yeah, so I, I reached out, and yeah, Officer uh, Bell, that's when he pretty much like pushed me out of the building. Then it was like, if you don't exit the building, I'm, I'm going to arrest you. He keeps saying, push me out of the building. He told you to leave? He told me to leave. Sorry. He told me to leave as soon as he got there. Anything beyond telling you to leave? He said... Because of his authority, you went ahead and left. That's what, what occurred? Yeah, because he threatened me with arrest, I left, yes. Right. Oh, Sergeant Dollar came? Yeah, Sergeant Dollar came because I requested a supervisor. Uh, could I, the issue I had with Officer Bell was that he said that they asked me to leave because I was causing a disturbance. I asked him, I said, well, what was the disturbance? He said, they said you called a disturbance. I said, well, did you ask them, right, to, like try to clear it up? I said, I, did, I said one sentence to them, right? I came in, they said that I'm causing a disturbance because I'm recording. My camera cannot be caused as a, as a disturbance. He said, they said you're a disturbance, you gotta go. After that, he didn't, we pretty much didn't have any other, you know, conversation. Okay. Right, we waited for Officer Dillard or Dollar, to, Dollar. He came out there, I informed him of the same thing. He said, you know, well, we're gonna trespass you from the building. I said, trespass you for what? What crime? Right, what crime did I, you know, did I break? I asked him what was it? What a disturbance was, could be less than a crime, but still a disturbance. Right, but I asked him, I understand what you're yo, saying. what was the I disturbance? I understand your, your point. I'm saying it doesn't have to be a crime. It can be just a disturbance. But anyway, go ahead. Right. So I, I just asked him that. He said, well. Do you know what the issue is there? Because I was the one that Sergeant, I mean, uh, Officer Jones here called. Mm -hmm. And I told him that even though they had a sign, remember when you and Officer Jones the oh, was that him right there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When he called, that was me he was talking. About. Okay. So, you see where I stand. Right. And I made the call there. The, the issue with it, and I'm curious to see at the end of this, the six, is they buzz you in there. And so, like this, we buzz you in too, but this is where the public comes without appointment, without anything. They just come to carry out business. If they say, because you know, you can't control, like we can't control back here. Okay. You know, and then we can still invite you back here. But yet, you wouldn't have so called public access to that's all locations. Because that's our like a thing where it buzzes in. But I'm not sure if that's by appointment only at that building, at that door. That's understandable. I'm assuming it doesn't. It, it's not so. That's why I made the call I made. That they buzz just to make sure that. Right. So the issue was not after, because if the administrator would have came down or admin person would have came down, they said, hey, 
beyond this point is not public access, right? And if you want to continue to have this conversation, then you have to turn just the, the camera. Fact, the, the argument that I'm curious what the state attorney was saying is just the fact that you have to be buzzed in. Into where? Where you went to. I did not have to be buzzed into. Okay. Yeah, where I was at was. And the one with M, you did. No, that was open too. Oh, Wait. I had to be buzzed in when I went up there. No, they, if you were there, the door was locked. Yeah, they locked the door. When I went there, it was not locked. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was not locked. I just remember thinking that when I went there, I had to be buzzed in. No, it was, yeah, it wasn't locked. That, it was a lady there that was like, after this, just keep the door locked. We're just going to keep the door locked, which that is, you know, right. But the, even the location I right, went to in 1910 was Is there anything else you want to report real quick? Just uh, I, I keep cutting you off of these other conversations. I just want to make sure I've gotten everything that you want to report at this point. Uh. Oops. Sergeant Dollar came in and he backed up what the officer said. Is that what you're trying to Correct. Do? Correct. I also wanted to, was there any type of, I didn't get any documentation of the trespass. That was a verbal trespass. Okay. If you guys logged anything or if it's like documented in any way, but it's not documented in any way. Okay. I don't think so. I'll check. I got to go get some paperwork for you to fill out. It's up to you. Mm -hmm. You want to fill it out or not? Okay. Um, no, I just wanted to make sure that if that I want to talk to somebody else because I don't want to talk to Officer D Dollar, right? That if the trespass stands, right, then I would, you know, obviously I would try no, to. There's no official trespass, not in Maryland. It's not like they would have to get court order to have it. Mm -hmm. So it would stand where from this point on. When we say trespass, we just mean at that very moment. Okay. And nothing beyond that. Okay. We don't have the authority to trespass you. Now, a business can say you are, but that's them saying it. That's not okay. So I'll I tell you, this is, this is kind of where... You want to see if the social services consider you trespassing after that day. I, I didn't even get to talk to them. I had no interaction with them whatsoever. Like, I still have business that I need to conduct there, but... I thought you were there just to report. No, I have business that I needed okay. to conduct there. I was prevented from doing that by the guard and then follow on by the police. So I still need to get there, but if the trespass... I have to fight the trespass so that I can go back and to complete my business. So that's why I, I came here. That's, on that's not on us. So if I go back to that building, I will not be arrested by you guys for so trespass. we don't have no standing trespass. Okay. So if you go back there in the day and they say trespass, we'd have to go through the whole thing and probably call the state attorney's office. But right. like you said, merely reporting in a public place is not disorderly conduct. Correct. Is there a, is there a way? I, I want to do the complaint process just to, really it's just training at this point because on Officer Bell, this young gentleman here, as well as Officer Lott, since they all backed up the same story. I don't want to have any issues with the police department, right? I didn't call you guys. I'd rather not interact with you if I don't have to. So if you, if you can educate them, that would be great for me so that when I go out there, I don't have no problems. I started and I had a conversation with a couple of officers. I, I probably still have to talk to Officer Bell. Um, and I certainly can sit down and make sure everyone even Sergeant Dollar. I'm, I'm more of a senior sergeant. I appreciate that. Um, so, that being said, and like I said, me and Mike already had a talk. Uh, that being said, do you want to make an official complaint? Because you were kind of were already with Sergeant Dollar. So, it's up to you. We can continue, or, or do we consider this settled? Or do you want the paperwork and fill it out? The only thing, as far as the, you know, removing, you can't, I'm good with that. You educate them, I'm fine with that. The only thing I'm not okay with was Officer Bill putting his hands on me. That was not okay. He had no right to put his hands on me, push me. I consider that to be an assault. You didn't say that. Who didn't say that? You did. Say what? That he put his hands on me. Oh, yeah, he put his hands on me. He I'm physically, oh, okay, I'm sorry. He I, I physically. Like, trying to get to the point yeah, where yeah, yeah. Said, he, I said, so you left because of his authority and... So he... I, I was... Mean, he didn't physically put you out. He verbally put you out. So when I was... I was pretty much at the door, right? At the door of the... Where you get buzzed in. 
he pushed me, physically pushed me to the front, to the exit. And then at that point, pulled out his handcuffs and was like, if you don't leave right now, I will arrest you. That is when I decided to just walk out of the building. So I'm going to get you the paperwork. All right. Okay. Where does this go after I give this? This is all part of the packet. This is all voluntary from this point out. Okay. Uh, you've already made your report. Your report will be documented. Okay. Um, everything else is just to help along that process. It's perfectly voluntary whether you want to do it or not. Is it, is it possible? Is it possible? You tell me if it is or not. It's up to you, up to you guys, right? I'm not here to try to, like, tackle the police department. I just want to make that at least be known. If I can get a formal apology from Officer Bell, not going to happen? No. Okay, then, yeah. We go with it. Yeah. But you reported, you reported. It's okay. Like, at that point. You know what I'm saying? That's why... I, I mean, I, I don't know you guys' process. I mean, I'm... I'm a, That's fine. Yeah. I'm just saying, but, you know, I would still have to report it. That's my point. Okay. About the apology part. They do have, um, and I'll put that, um, they do have an arbitration sort of situation where they, they'll sit you two down and that will serve at that purpose. Okay. Um, but that's done officially after I've done my report. Right. Okay. If, if it's a situation that could be handled through mediation, they will do that. Okay. And you'll get a call. Um, Give me a piece of paper. I'm not talking. Right here. Stay here. What's your name? Uh, my name is Mac. First name Mac. M A C K. That's That's all I want to put on the report. Yeah. Answer whatever you want to. Don't answer anything you don't want to. Uh, phone number you can be reached at? Uh, no phone number. Uh, date of birth? No date of birth. Address? No address. I got email. Oh, email? Yeah, email. Uh, G as in golf, C as in Charlie, A as in alpha, relay, R-E-L-A-Y, at gmail.com. If you don't want to wait any longer, you can just leave it with him. Otherwise, I'll come back and we can talk to him. All right. Appreciate it. All Thank right. you. Okay. Um, I didn't know which building was 1910, but then I watched it. And just the first building where you were with Mike, where you went into, right. is 100% 
a public space. That's where people go to the uh, Officer uh, Jones. That's where yeah. you go. That building, you're going into administration building. And that, you, that building is obviously not a public building. It, it is a public building. No, it's not. The you just, like, you can't just walk past this door. Right, because it's, our desk. That's because it, it's a secure our building. Desk. I, I still would like to complete my business at that location, and I want, I'm going to be recording in the process. So, if you can get that permission from them to let you come back there while you're I don't need their permission. So, if they ask me to stop, I'm not going to stop. They, you guys are going to get called back uh, and out. And they're not going to invite you back there. It's, a, it's an office space. It's, it's an office space. It is, but as th that building being like having government employees and I'm requesting a service from them, if they decide to not service me, that's a different case. But they, but as just telling me to not record because they don't want to, they don't have, right. They can say that. They say, Hey, we're not going to service you. But what they cannot say is you have to turn your camera up. They can say, we'll give you service. I don't think they'll say that either. The guard said that who called you guys. No, they said, turn your camera off. You cannot record. And now you need to leave because that's why they're not going to let you in there. No, no, I, I definitely have a document. They said, you need okay. to stop recording. And then I said, I'm not going to stop recording. They said, well, you need to leave. It was in that order. And they said, that's okay. right, so when I do go back, if they do call you guys, that's what it's going to be for because they don't want me to record. And I know I have the right to record. And if they, they call the because really they should just report it and call the government employee because now they're impeding on my business. They don't have any grounds for that. Correct. And I have to deal with that. But at the same time, that could be construed as trespassing on the property. And it, it will be back in this situation. I have no problem with that because I, I know I'm in the right. So if we end up back in this situation, then, you know, so be it. I just want to make sure that I go back over. They're going to say, hey. Oh, did, you get my, did you get my information? Your information? How you say your last name? Plato, like Plato, but with a K. K L A D O. Oh, Plato. Okay, it's right there. Okay. Well, I, I appreciate it. Hopefully, I don't have no other issues. I don't have to deal with this. So, but I appreciate it. I think it's just better you talking to the right person down there at social service. Mm -hmm. what, you, what you want. All right, take care. Thank you. All right, good citizens. So, yeah, I'll wrap to y'all for a little bit, right? Uh, I mean, Sergeant Clato, looked like that's what his name is. He, back and forth, you know, at first he said, well, we don't have no issue. Then he went back, I guess, and, and looked at the footage and, you know, said that, oh, maybe it, you know, is is not a blocked area or, or not a blocked area, but uh, maybe it's not a... Uh, what do you call it? Common area. And, you know, maybe he's just misinformed. But he did. Uh, what we did want to clarify is that the uh, trespass was was no longer there. And as long as we got that clarity, we, we should be good to go. Because we're definitely going back over there to, you know, complete our business. And, yeah, they get called back out. They get called back out. Yeah, bother me. Um, so, and we'll handle it accordingly, but we would definitely want to hold them accountable. Uh, again, we're not in this to take out the police. Like, we're trying to take the police out. We just want them to be educated so that they, if they do get called on scene, they, you know, respect our rights to 
you know, record in public and public, public accessible areas. And as long as they do that, we we'll no problem, right? I don't ever call them. So if, if that was the case, then it would be a different story. But I'm, I'm not the one calling the police. So they should just stand in line, come out there, uphold the, the, the Constitution. And then we should be good to go. All right, who taking this request? Mm. Ready. <laughs> hey. You said I want a, a, a copy? Yes. I appreciate that. There you go. Thank you. I'm just going to be talking to my audio right now, just so you know. Oh, okay. While well, I'll wait for my copy. Okay. Absolutely not. All right, good citizens. So this is the same place we was violated. Uh, yeah, we got that rectified. Um, we submitted a PI request. They're getting ready to uh, make us a copy of it. Yeah, 1910 North Broadway. I'm not sure what the issue was. I'm pretty sure. I mean, sometimes you just can't reason with some people, you know. Um, but they definitely taking care of it now. Uh, they may be upset with it, but it's okay. But like I said, I went over to the to the police station, and they said that this was not a uh, public accessible area. And I just want to make sure that I capture that. Because you guys are aware, you know, this this door is not locked, right? It's publicly accessible. As you can see, the hours, 8.30 to 5 o'clock, the door is open, as you can see. Um, and I'm not sure what, I think he was talking more about the other door, which I, I, I didn't even make it that far. So we came in. Um, this is the foyer, common lobby, uh, where you can go and you request services. Uh, we came down this area. Uh, this is the sign that they referenced, which again, as we have mentioned time and time again, that it is, I mean, it holds no weight. I don't know. I'm not sure why it's still present. Uh, this is another sign that we are in contact with DHS on, mainly because of the H here. Not sure. I'm not sure if you see they have their security with this public accessible camera, which we also requested that footage. So we'll see how that goes about. Um, and this is, the, this is the, the door where you come to and it is uh, secure. They have a badge here and it's also somewhere in the office they can open the door. But as you notice, it is definitely locked. And that is where the public accessible areas do stop. So again, we cleared that up with the, with the police department uh, they said they're going to educate their staff. So hopefully we don't have any other inter interactions with them that, you know, violates our constitutional right uh, while we're trying to conduct our business. So, and we're just going, you know, we're going to hold tight. Uh, she should be coming out with our, with our PI request, PI request. And then, uh, hey, we'll, we'll be good to go. And, uh, you know, no problem. So. Again, hey, it's a, it's a long one, but uh, I mean, sometimes you got to do what you got to do. There is a complaint in process with the police department. So, uh, you know, I, I went back and forth. I'm still thinking about if I want to do a, you know, an intent to sue on the security guards uh, by the, the police department. You know, if they would have came out and cleared it up, it would have been okay. Uh, I did, I, I did, as you noticed, you know, I said, hey, you know, we can squash this, get my formal apology. We'll be on our way. No, no problem. And, you know, we'll, 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 see what that, we'll see what that look like. So, again, I appreciate all y'all. And, you know, rocking with me. And, uh, you know, I hope this, <laughs> hope this don't happen again. So, yeah, just hang tight. There we, there we go. We're like, she's on our way with our copy. There we go. It's being submitted. I appreciate that. Thank you. All right. Just like that. Finally, you know, we got a PIA request done, and I mean, man, oh, talk about a victory lap. Let's let's do our victory lap. You know, 
go over to the other building. <sighs> they put in a nice little piece of paper for me, so. Again, when I went back over, that building had a child in it. And I mean, I just, I don't want to record the child. So, you know, again, same thing. I, you know, I would love to do my Victory Lab in this building. I, I just, I would prefer not to record the child. I know that I can, I, but I, you know, I, I don't want to. So I, I don't want to record any children. Uh, if I if I can help it, you know, but we definitely want to. Anyway, we did we did a lap, but let's 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 see what that looked like in this, in this building. So they do have uh, kids in here, uh, so I'm not gonna go. In. I did I did just talk to the guard. Uh, he ain't had no issues. So we're gonna we're gonna ride out. Oh, damn it. Get that back up. There we go. Yeah, so but we can have no no more issues with that building, right? So we're gonna go ahead and get out of here. We got other places to go. Other things to do. So we out.